everyone and welcome back to building tricks with chips and you guys crushed the support last time and this is episode two we're gonna do trees i'm pretty sure dan the fan made this technique but it's hard to find a good tutorial so in this video i'm gonna show you how to make it You're going to want to start off with two types of leaves, one like darker and one lighter. And for this case, I'm going to use these yellowish ones. Now here's the tricky part, and this is a really hard process. It requires a lot of patience. See how there's like this little gap right there, and then there's like this little point right there you're gonna want to like squeeze that point through and then you might have to bend it back these um, leaves are bendable so that should be easier and again it could fall apart at any moment I mean it's pretty strong but not that strong and this again requires a lot of patience and we're gonna do that a couple more times I'm not gonna make it super big but we're just gonna do a couple more times so you can see the final result here we have this little tree part that you're gonna need, and this isn't that big. You're gonna need ones way bigger, but again, this could fall apart again, and you know, it's not that sturdy. It could be a little misshaped, but that's okay because trees aren't perfect. When we put on the tree, we're gonna use it upside down. I know that might seem weird, but it's gonna make a lot more sense and because it gets wider over there now let's build the base of the tree so to do this we're going to start with these brown circular pieces we're going to get six of those and we're just going to build them up We're gonna get this like cylinder piece. They're not the most common. I'm using an orange one, so it worked out well, but it's supposed to be this big. Then add this bigger circular plate. I don't know why, but it just kind of helps it a little more. We're gonna take some more of these brown pieces and you can see here, there's like this pole going through. That makes it more strong. So if you want it to be strong. And now you can add these different colored of brown bricks because you can't really see this through the tree. You're gonna make it as tall as you want and you're gonna use this like tipped piece at the top. And next we're gonna get nine of these leaf pieces weaved together and we are going to put it on upside down or how I do it in this video. And it could fall apart again. This is a really hard process requires a lot of patience. It was really frustrating for me, but the final result is worth it. And it could accidentally, you know, slide down, but that's okay. Next, we're gonna use a layer of eight of these leaf pieces and again, put it in upside down. Now, seven of the leaf pieces, and again, you're gonna put it in upside down. Now you're gonna get six of these leaves weaved and you're gonna put it on, this time not upside down. For the final and top row, you're gonna only need four leaves weaved together. This time again, they're gonna face up top, not upside down. And that finishes off the top of the tree. That's about it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. And again, we need five likes for another episode. And again, this is um, by Dan the Fan, I'm pretty sure. So go check him out. And you know, this is a, um, a long, tedious process. And I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.